61A, lecture number 17. Announcements. I'm in Germany, and so there will be guest lectures in Monday and Wednesday of this week. On Monday, Catherine, on Wednesday, Kavi will talk about objects and inheritance, respectively. I think they'll do a great job. Those are for the live lectures. You'll have my regular videos for these online lectures. The additional topics guest lecture this week will be by Rahul, who wrote the graphical user interface that we distributed with the CATS project. That's the part that ran in the browser and highlighted your words as you typed. If you want to learn how to do that, come to his guest lecture Wednesday at 5 p.m. in 3106 Echeverry. Homework 4 is extra long, so it's worth 4 points, and it's due this Thursday. And if you want to revise your HOG project to get back any composition points you lost, do that by Thursday as well. And today, we will release the Ants vs. Some Bees project, which will be due next Thursday. But I recommend turning it in a day early for a bonus point. And there's a checkpoint to finish the first handful of problems by next Monday to make sure that you get started and you're on track to complete the project on time. Today we start a new part of the course where we discuss object-oriented programming. We've built up many of the foundational concepts of object-oriented programming already. It combines the idea of mutable values with ideas of data abstraction in order to support the metaphor that a complex program isn't just one long line of instructions, but instead consists of many objects interacting with each other by sending messages and updating their own local state accordingly.